Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I've got another Panda palette update for you guys. Um, this is the last update of this year. We're at the start of December, so no more updates, just the finale after this one. And the finale is probably gonna come up a little bit later into January because I will be traveling around the time that I would normally try to get it up just so you know but let's take a look at where i am at so first of course we're going to look at the Too faced enchanted glamourland palette and let's take a look at what that looked like last time and then this is where i am with that one right now um it's only two shadows so we can go through this one pretty quickly i've been using the silver pretty much every day on my eyes at the moment so there is a clear dip in there right now which was kind of my goal um nowhere near pen yet but we're making progress it's moving i'm actively using it which is something i haven't done in like most of the two years that i've been working on this palette so yeah ooh and ah uh, as the color is called is moving um and i might actually repress it in here for when i go traveling so i'm it might not be in this palette anymore next time you see it but that's that one and then stiletto is um also coming along nicely i'm not gonna have this one finished by the end of the year for sure but i've hit sideband on the other side of it so right now i'm working on the top part and i've actually i feel like i've made some nice progress on that as well um also for that one i don't think i will be able to get all of that done by next time i do have a black in here so i don't really see the point of repressing that one in this palette yet um so I might be working more on the black in this one than in this one um, over the next month before you guys see the next update. So I don't know how much more progress I'm going to be making on this one, but I'm going to be working on it. So yeah, that's um, that one. <laughs> and then of course we also have the Too Faced Glamour To Go palette that I'm working on. Uh, let's take a look at what that one looked like. So if I remember correctly, my goals were to finish off the whitish gold shade, to finish off the pink shade. Um, finish off the upper half or whatever you want to call it of the bronzy shade and um, try and hit side pen on the blue one and now this is where we are right now so as you can see the gold shade is gone and the pink shade is gone i'm really really excited about that and i've also made a really good amount of progress on this one there really isn't that much left anymore so it's starting to become a bit of a boring <laughs> palette like this um what I've been doing with this one though is because um, this is the palette that I bring when I go to the gym I don't really bring anything else besides this so I'm using my face powder just to kind of like have a base layer I put the well I was still using the pink I only finished that up two days ago now I think um, so I put the pink in my crease then I put the blue kind of to darken it up so transition color crease color <laughs> Um, and then I would put this bronzy shade on my lid and I would go into the greenish one with my finger and the easiest way for me to kind of use this at this point is to go in with my finger and then basically tap off my finger to get the more chunky glitters off of it and that way then I tap that on my lid and because of the like warmth from my finger it doesn't really give me too much chunky glitter fallout um, either and then I use the black in my outer V and as my eyeliner so that has been my main go-to look um, and when I'm at home I would use the silver in the other palette and the black in the other palette so that's what I've been doing but let's take a quick look at these colors individually so I finished off the gold and the pink so let's move on to the blue um, I had some pen on there last time and my goal was to try and hit side and as you can see I did not do that but I feel like I've been kind of like swirling my brush around a little bit more instead of like focusing on one specific side. So the pan has grown more kind of all around, but I am starting to see a little bit of side pan on the top or bottom part, depending on like which direction you hold this. Um, so I do feel like I can hit side pan on that one by next time. The black, I've also managed to work my way a little bit towards this side. And also for this one, I'm pretty sure I can hit side pen by next time. So that's pretty nice. Um, this one, I'm probably going to be using more over the next um, month because I will be traveling. And this is one of the colors that will be a little bit more of my focus during the travel as well. And then, of course, the bronzy color. Um, I don't have that much left in here anymore. So my goal is to just finish this one off. I'm probably going to bring 
another warmer color with me as well because otherwise I will just have cool tones and I just like some warmer tones on my lids as well. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of excited to see this because the moment I finished off these two extra colors, even though one of them already came from the other palette, this palette looks so much more finished and I know I'm gonna have another pan empty by next time so I'm pretty excited about that. Um, yeah, definitely happy with the progress that I made this time around. So, like I said, I do have some goals for next time. Now, in this palette, I don't have too much of a goal because I think I'm going to try and take out some of the silver, at least, to repress in here. It might still be too much for one pan, but we'll see how far we can get. And the black, I'm going to be still be working on for the next like few weeks that I'm still here. But once I'm traveling, I won't bring this one with me and I'll just use the black in here and try to make some nice progress on that one. So yeah, that is uh, it for this one. And then for the Too Faced Glamour To Go palette, my goals are kind of to hit side pen on the black right here, hit side pen on the blue and finish this one off. I don't think I will be making any major progress on this one, but I will be using it a little bit more. So. Yes, that is it for now. So only one more month and a little bit in my case, just because I don't get a chance to film a whole lot earlier. Um, and then we're done for this year and this year's challenge. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed watching this. That's it for now. And I hope to see you in one of my next videos. Bye-bye.